So I don't know if you've heard this, but there's some new Megan Thee Stallion, Tory Lanez case that just came out. And it's probably about the wildest story we've heard so far. Just when you think all has been said, <laughs> there's more. The man in jail. But apparently there may be a video that is supposed to be coming out that will get Tory Lanez free and ruin Megan Thee Stallion. Because allegedly, this now big blogger, Wack 100 slash gangster slash guy who's kind of like in the middle of like these situations where like videos get leaked and he's the he's the guy that usually has the dirt on everybody okay. on the West Coast. Okay. So he released the audio. He said this on Clubhouse on his show, the Wack 100 show. It's a very popular show. Saying that there's a video that may be coming out that could ruin everything for Megan and get Tory released. So this is what he had to say. Say is this. When the video come out that the DA tried to suppress that my legal was now involved in, there will not be a no more Megan Stallion. Oh, shit. Clip it. Clip that shit. The appeal is coming. When the video comes out, from the little Asian girl that followed them from the time they saw him arguing in the car that the DA tried to suppress and threaten their family with all kind of other shit. Shout out to the private investigators. I want to see what the Magic Stallion fans are going to say then. I want to see are y'all going to counsel her for lying and putting that black man in jail. We're going to see. I mean, if she's lying and okay, she can't and do that, she... she needs to go to jail. So that's what he is claiming. Now, okay, so let me put this in context for you. He has been at the center of a lot of drama over the years, WAC 100. And he is kind of, so I would say like this, there is a 50-50 chance this is real. Because <laughs> sometimes things get distorted. But it's. Right. But I also don't believe that he would be crazy enough to hop out here and say something this wild and there not be a video. I hope not. I mean, I don't. To be completely honest, I don't know what I want to see. Do I really want to see that this man is in jail for nothing? No. Do I really want to see that people thought she was lying and she wasn't? No. It's like there's no. Is there a win here? The only win that I guess that could come out of this is Tory Lanez. I mean, if, 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 if that's if that he didn't do, that would be the win. But why now? I mean, according to him, the DA tried to suppress it. They tried okay. to keep him out of it. I mean, then, you know, there's a lot of parties that are invest invested, you know, as far as money is concerned that are betting on, you know, Megan Thee Stallion's career to continue. So her, you know, there, there's some big money involved here. And like they had a lot into this story. Like it, if Meg, if Troy beat that case, I don't think Meg Thee Stallion is Meg Thee Stallion right now. And, and he's the bigger artist. He's the bigger artist at this point. I mean, even, I think he's always been the bigger artist. But even, like, now he's like Michael Jackson right now. If he's out of jail and gets, you know, he gets cleared of all charges. So apparently he's saying that there was this little Asian girl who allegedly saw the whole thing play out, recorded it, followed them from the time that they got out the car, and there's a video of this. Now, a lot of people are saying, well, if there was a video, it would have been out. Not necessarily. If there have been cases where things have been withheld because it wasn't entered into evidence correctly, or like you said, there are people who benefit from the case going the way that it did. Exactly. So, I mean, who knows? I don't know. We don't know. We ain't seen the video. Again, I would say from the source, there's a 50-50 chance of this being real. It could just be blogger messy talk, <laughs> as easy as it could be a reality. Is he known to be truthful? Is he no reliable is the word that I'm looking for. Is he known to be reliable? Don't say don't tell me 50-50. <laughs> because like they on that side of because I actually been on this show before. Mm -hmm. Um and it's, like I say, it's a big show on Clubhouse. Mm -hmm. And like Wait, Clubhouse is the um audio app. The audio yeah, so they do an audio uh, conversation. Okay. So it's like, yeah, yeah. they'll have like 10,000 people listening or something all at once. Got you. But that's what I'm saying. So they have a big live show slash podcast that they do. And I would say that it's 50-50 because they do. I have to say that because some of the stuff that they do. You're killing me, Smalls. Because <laughs> some of this, and I'm trying to be political, but some of the stuff that they do is manufactured. Like they will oh. run plays to generate clicks on that side of the Internet. Not just him, but that whole side of the Internet. They do certain things. 
I, but I'm not saying he's a liar. He's also the guy. He's also the same guy. I don't know if you ever heard of the Nipsey Hustle video. So this allegedly was his Nipsey Hustle video. It's in peace, Nipsey. Mm-hmm. Uh, uh, him in a you know threesome with another man, and he's doing some other things with his girlfriend. Oh. Yeah. Hold on, you taking me too fast. You wait, what? Yeah. So I might. I don't really want to get into it because we don't have the video. But it's not because you know he was also in some daily. He's been a, at the center of a lot of situations. Right. You get what I'm saying? So how though? Like he's a he's a well known uh, executive slash uh, pi- gang gang member slash a lot of things. So so if people have information, they would be likely to give it to him. Exactly. He traffics in that information sometimes. Okay. So, you know he got his ear to the streets and people. You know so he gets stuff. So he's known for breaking stories and having that type of information. So. Like I said, with him, it literally could be real. Like, I mean, sometimes he'd be 100% on point. Sometimes they just be making stuff up over there. Like, you know, that's a part of their hustle. That gives me chills to think about the fact that it could possibly be a video, though. That's scary. I think it changes a lot, and I think that could derail Meg's rise. Because right now she's on the rise, and I just think that that could kind of derail it all. Um, especially if the video shows contrary to what people think. Mm, so yeah. if there is a little Asian girl that follows them <laughs> and has a video, you know, we'll see how it goes. But even the guy that was the actual eyewitness that saw the whole thing and his story didn't match I up. I heard about that. His story was was... It was quite a few details that were different. like he was saying he was like he saw three people fighting and it was like a whole melee and then some like a gun went off or something like that. I don't remember the exact story, but his story his story didn't match the story that you know the official right, story. Right, right. He was an eyewitness, but again, you know these cases are a lot more complicated than one person's testimony. Absolutely. And just in general, when you are going through a case like you said, it's the job of the prosecutor to win the case. They're not trying to, um, they're not trying to pursue justice the job that's, right. that's really the judge's yeah. job is to make sure that the trial is fair it's the job of the prosecutor to win so if they can get that piece of evidence thrown out for whatever reason or to keep someone from ha- saying something that's what they're gonna do exactly so that's how our justice system works it's not about if there was evidence in the prosecutor he, they're not stepping back this case too big we're not turning back now we have seen many instances where there was video proof and it still went a complete opposite like how did How did it go this way? But they do their job. Exactly. So I guess we just got to wait and see how it plays out. Hopefully this video comes out sooner than later because if the man is in jail and he is essentially innocent, man, that would be crazy. This is holding up his freedom. Yeah. And if there is a video, if I was to, I'd be paying them to leak that shit tomorrow. (laughs) Hey, get that. Hey, if y'all don't drop that shit, man. So like I said, I would be surprised if he just came out of blue and said this and there was nothing else that came after it. But I guess we'll just have to wait and see. 